Hello everyone, it's Brandon Strange, and today we're gonna play more Amnesia to Dark Ascent. Let's go right in. So last time we ended up here in the machinery room, and uh, yeah, it's actually been like at least two months since I've played Amnesia. Um, so, so yeah, let's hope I'm still oriented. So I still remember these, but mainly because I just edited the third, ep third episode, so... What is this place? Is, uh, how is he saying that? It's like Daniel... I don't know if that was Daniel or July, 1839. Today, I went to the university looking for answers. I was able to sneak into Herbert's office and pick up an address book along with some relevant textbooks. Professor Taylor at the Faculty of History was very helpful and I managed to approach the subject of the orbs. The most interesting aspect was the prevalent trace they had left in our culture. The mythic orbs may, in fact, have inspired the Globus Cruciger, which so many royal regalia holds to this day. In ancient times, the orbs were held by priests as a symbol of the sun and its power. As I was leaving, I overheard a disturbing conversation. Sir William Smith, the geologist, was killed last night. Less than a fortnight had passed since I'd asked for his expertise. Fortnight. I know it's silly, but I can't help feeling responsible somehow. So silly. What is doing? Okay. Um. Oh God. Wait. Uh, no. There. The meter should read up eight and down eight. Is there an eight? Five and three. Five. Three. I don't know. God, is this a puzzle? Are we gonna die out of old age? Okay, the lantern should go out, yeah. I'm stupid. How's my heart? A few cuts and bruises. Alright, that's that's we have two of London on on on, but still. Right, let's go downstairs. Ooh, this place looks creepy. Oh god, okay. <laughs> Hello. This looks important. Let's keep that there. A hey, Tinder box. Hey look, PlayStation. Track 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 tr flow. <laughs> okay. Um wait. Yeah. Never mind. Let's just keep it here. Machine equipment demo. Know that then know that there are only two spare rods left in the storage for the elevator machinery. Make sure to only discard the ones which are badly damaged and keep the others in the inner study rooms in case all three would crack again. All right, all right. 14th of July, 1839. I've read every book I can find on the subject. While rich in legend and hearsay, my knowledge is lack for the insight I crave. I've sent letters to many in Herbert's address book and received answers of varying importance. Today, I got one which differed greatly from the others. From a baron in Prussia. He said nothing about the quaint stories of priests in underground temples. He didn't even mention them. He simply wrote, I know. I can protect you. Come to Brennenburg Castle. Signed, Alexander. What am I to make of this? Protect me from what? Is someone after me? I looked up Brennenburg and traced it to the Prussian woods near the Baltic Sea. While being the least informative letter I've received, it causes <coughs> the greatest distress and interest. As I write, my thoughts are drawn to my nightmares in which a most disturbing sound calls to me. A sound defying description. A voice from the void. The last few weeks have been awful, with so many sleepless nights dreading a repeat of those horrid dreams. Tomorrow, I shall visit my physician, Dr. Tate, in hope that he can provide me with sedatives to help me sleep. Okay. Who's after me? Someone trying to kill me? Is it perhaps that thing without the face? Wait. 
That's probably a dumb idea. But yeah. <laughs> okay, let's leave it here. I, I was actually thinking you can pick it up because in the darkness, stuff that you can usually pick up glows a little bit. Like a very mild glow. Right, let's stay at a light for a little bit. Okay. See, it's light. It's good. Me personally, I actually like darkness more than light. <laughs> Not in like a scary way, but um, in uh, 17th of July, 1839. <laughs> How has this escaped me? They're all dead. Limbs scattered, heads split down the middle, their skin oh, flayed as if boiled. Okay. I feel like I'm falling into myself. What's happening? Sir William Smith. Professor Taylor, now Dr. Tate. Is it following me? How can it not be? It's the damn thing I brought from Africa. Something is after me. I have no choice but to trust the Baron. He better know what he claims. If he is wrong, I suspect he'll regret it as well. Hell yeah. What did you bring from Africa? Is that the... The, 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 the relic, the stone, whatever. That blue thing. Oh, look. Okay, I'm gonna collect these actually. Well, not collect them, just put them in a more obvious spot. Because actually, maybe they. The cogwheel does not fit on this hole. Ah, there we go. Alright, let's create that. Let's take that one. Do I hear something? I'm just going nuts. Ah, there's another one, okay. So we got all three of them. Sweet. Alright, can we push this one with this one? Okay. Number one. Yeah, exactly how it's supposed to work. Okay. <laughs> I have Tugel Crouch, I should probably disable it. I don't like Tugel. Okay, let's put these cocks on those picks. There we go, right. There's a lever. Machinery needs more work before it will run. Okay, okay, okay. Is that why you collected people from Africa? <laughs> okay. Oh, thank God. Okay. I think I should maybe put some like epilepsy warnings on the start of these videos. I do that. I mean, when recording, I do actually put warnings, but. I don't, I'm not sure with amnesia, it's not like there's some dangerously blinking lights, but this could be enough. There's nothing for the burner to ignite. We have a lot of boxes and books. I don't think that'll work. <laughs> Plus it... Wait, is it set to ignite or... Oh yeah, okay. I guess we're looking for some coal, maybe? Or chop wood? Why do we want to- There's nothing left. Everything's gone. No, no. Books. Let's, let's burn the books. Maybe. Let's see. See, seriously, why do I use this lantern? I don't need it all the time. There. Is that enough? There's nothing in the burner to ignite. Okay, I guess this has to be an item and not an object. Okay, ow, my balls are. What the fuck just happened? <laughs> What's missing here? I don't have an iP I don't have a PlayStation. Circle. No one X. Sc 
cut this part, Thomas. Okay. And maybe I have to go into other rooms. Let's see what the... Why the cogwheels, anyway? Oh, this is a coal room. Man, I am an idiot. Jesus Christ. It's literally right next to it. Okay, how much? You even have a book there, so it's something to foil it with. Alright. Hey, eh. The burner needs more coal. Okay. So you just won't start without more coal. That's some advanced shit, man. Is free enough? Or should I just put everything there? Oh, okay. So, can I do it now? No. I'm guessing we need the cranks. But how should I know? Down again, should use the steam engine to build up pressure before channeling into the machinery. Adjust the levels to get the right amount of pressure inside the chamber. The meter should read up eight and down and make sure to train any steam set functions for no, not the machinery will not check proper configuration until all rods are inserted. Okay, so we need to insert all of the rods, uh, but what is here? Pressure did not say flow, or something else said flow. Um, pressure inside the chamber, the meter should read up 8 and down 8. But what is up and what is down? Maybe like this? 3? What's this? It's a 5. Okay, let's try this. 1. It's a 4. 3. So that's 4. And like this. There you go. And... 5, 2, 2, which would be 9, 1, 3, and 4, at 7, 5, oh shit, this one cannot be done, I think, I'm not good at math, so 1, 4, 5, and this is 7, the float is even and stable, what? That's seven, not eight. Wait, so is... What? So did it actually do it somehow? I thought the, you know, the three on the left were from for one and the one on the right was for the second. Okay, Jesus. Up floor cycle on. Yeah, that's because I don't know if it's actually supposed to be. I don't know what the fuck to do. Let's check it again. I don't think it still will work because of the rods. If not, I'll just have to get out of here and try to find them. <coughs> Is it still burning? Yeah. No, okay. Did you have any notes? Trouble from a cave in his under. Okay, I think we already. 
previous episode. We already read that. My neck is itchy. What is happening to me? Seriously. Sorry again for not being energetic. The COVID thing is still fucking hurting me. And it's not fun. I know it's... It, most he bended heavily trying his best to keep himself from screaming the medicine cabinet had been overtuned and lay collapsed on the floor he reached through the broken glass door and grabbed all the sedatives he could find so the previous the third episode well actually um i noticed while editing well no actually while well, it was already exported because of course um that there's a lag in the voice and that's actually because of these loading screens now it should be fixed so let's see if it's actually fixed. Does it work now somehow? It's not working. Yeah, it would be very fucking surprising. Okay, where could we go? Let's try to go from the starts again. So from here and we'll go... Wait, something here. Probably just oil and stuff. Yeah. Something on the other side. Maybe something behind the well. There's a base. Can we crash that? Yeah! Destructibility! I've already been here, I know. Don't forget your bag, Daniel. I won't, Herbert. There is no shame in using a parasol in the desert. As it happens, it's imperative to your survival. But it looks ridiculous. The shade will hurt much less than dying, I assure you. But if it won't? Some kind of blue thingy, a blue substance. Alright, what is here again? Storage. Cranks could be there. He flipped through the book of monocar monarchs looking for etchings and counted nine different kings from all over Europe had been de debated with an orb resting in their hands. I should probably start calling it an orb instead of the other things I've been calling it. Where is this girl equipment? Primary. The vault valve is rusted shut. How are we gonna repair that? Can we? Stop lagging. Stop lagging! There's two. Or maybe that's the same one. I'm just very stupid. It's just a huge possibility. Let's play must be so boring. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I, I just I don't have the energy to entertain and the brain. <clears throat> oh my god. I think that if if you would meet another person in amnesia, I would remember it. Because you know there'll be a lot of like like clips and stuff like that. Well, in the early days, I don't think people would really post this quick 30 seconds clips from games. Like important moments, etc. I think you know what I'm talking about. But who the hell is crying? Like it weirdly sounds like a little girl and an adult at the same time. It's terror strong.
nothing here, nothing anywhere. Machine parts. Yeah. Wait, isn't this the place? It won't budge. Fucking drill. No. Hmm. Why do I still have the acid thing? Okay, what's this? Equipment? Oh, I've been there. Okay, let's go back then. Check another door. I'm sorry. Sir William Smith has been marked. There was no way for him to know that the young man from the other day cast such a horrible shadow. Terrible shadow. Bruh, can't raid. Can't raid at all, bruh. Yes. Professor Taylor was the second death caused by his damned curiosity. I already read this. Right? Oh, what? Did that move? Look, cockroach or what the fuck ever is that? Oh, this is the places where the jackets are or whatever. Ropes, I guess maybe. Oil. Yes, and oil. That's how you freaking tell it. Wait, what? What? Is that is that a bug? I don't think that's really supposed to be there. Oh, you mother! Oh no, that's a coat hanger. I love shit. <laughs> I thought it was a lever. I'm just gonna assume everything's a lever by now. Paintings? No. Okay, the guest room seems like there's nothing going to be here. Nothing is going to be here. He panted heavily, trying his best to keep himself from screaming. The medicine cabinet had been overtuned, we already read this, and lay collapsed to the floor. He reached through the broken glass door and grabbed all the sedatives he could find. These fucking background sound effects. Stupid. He flipped through the book of monarchs, looking, looking for etchings and counted nine different and counted. Nine different kins from all over Europe had been de depicted with an orb resting in their hands. Okay, so I guess these texts, messages are the same based around what part in the house we are. Also, what part loading, uh, what loading image is it? This one is the arm. in here a chest empty probably already searched through piano no and who do we have here the defender of our king Oh, sorry. Okay, please don't tell. Okay, I'm gonna put you on the highest throne. On a very... Oh, shit, okay. Okay, okay, okay. No, nobody saw that. Nobody. He, he's fine. Aren't you fine? LSP. I mean... <laughs> okay. <clears throat> oh, my God. This is the fucking Chinese hat. I want the Chinese hat can use it in so many ways as a shield as a hat as a ball I, I don't know what I'm talking about I just got very lost in my head okay um, well there's nothing here too I'm also using all of my oil I'm very smart my intelligence is less than negative okay I don't think anything is going to be in there because we found some pretty important stuff there 
That's sense making. Milestones of human anatomy. This is where the doggy died. The head is not here. Hell nah. Sorry. You're going back to your brother. There you go. I'm just gonna assume that that's your brother. Um, want an apple? Dick! Well, this is still open. Some stuff are returns to their original place, but... Okay. Anyhow, I should... I, I mean, I'm going to check the window soon. I mean, the paintings, can they be lifted? Nah. Nah, fam. Okay, let's check that then. Still don't think there's anything going to... There's not, there's not going to be anything there, because... You know, we found the crank, I think. Oh, I didn't even notice the red stuff being there. <laughs> Damn, boy. Something is wrong. Oh, so wrong. Oh, so wrong. I can't believe it. Can I take the feather? The cogwheel. Oh, sweet. Oh, I thought it was not a cog. We have a I have enough of those though, right? Shit. Let's take this one again. See how deep this is. Let's throw a vase down here. It's here when it cracks. Well, that's pretty fucking deep. Okay. <laughs> I mean, I don't know how tall these forests are. I don't think I can see the ground. Hey, an owl. This game has good ambiance. Okay. Sir William Swift had been marked. There was no way for him to know that the young man from the other day cast such a terrible shadow. Okay, so what do I know is that in there, in the machinery parts, there's a locked door. Or it won't budge. Maybe it's not locked, it's just stuck. The drill doesn't work, nor the needle. Um, so, what other door is there? Except this one, of course. I really don't want to go back those those stairs. The strange letter frightened him, but it was also the only one which offered him some help. Wait, didn't it say where the cranks are? Notes, machine gun. Know that there are only two spare rods left in the storage for the elevator machine. Make sure to only to only discard the no ones which are badly damaged and keep. Okay, the storage. Weren't we just fucking there? Also, is this stuck? Yes. Okay, that's a good sign. Okay, I'm gonna go back to the storage then. Okay, first let's just check this room. Done. <laughs> okay, now let's go here. Oh my god. I mean, this looks like the place the rods would be at. But apparently, they aren't. This carpet. We need to. Like, do something with these carpets. Is the girl behind the locked door or something? I, I have no idea. 
Okay, there is nothing in here. I don't know why I closed the door. I could have kept it open. Alright, since... Let's go here first, equipment. This is where I was the first. Oh yeah, the rusty shit. Do I have something to... The drill, actually. That could actually help. Yeah! Ha! Fucking genius. Picked up partially filled pot with what? It is filled with one of the two ingredients for creating the explosive mixture. Why do I need that? Okay, there's also another one, but I don't have... Secondary. Wait. Okay, so now it's an explosive? Oh my god, okay. <laughs> Calm down, okay, okay, I'm sorry. A highly vol voltage mixture. So, should I blow up the door? Should I blow up the lock the door? Man, that should have hit me, man. I have a drill and something was rusty to, like, crank it. Well, not crank it, dude. To start a stream of the whatever is inside. Okay, I'm lost. Okay, there we go. Right, so now let's go to the passageway where the door locked or the budged door is. Let's see if we can use the explosive on it. Okay, what about here? Seems rather radical, but no. Oh, oh my god, okay. That actually freaking. For some reason, that actually jump scared me. Those stand too, too close to the blast when the explosive goes off. When will it? Should I arm it? It's like a firework situation. That for some reason jump scared me, the way the camera rolled. Okay, let, let's arm it. Arm it. Do not set down the explosive regard safe out. Oh, okay. Wait. <laughs> How will I set it from afar though? Am I now safe? How freaking like hard are these explosives? How about I just go into another area? Let me do that. Why am I losing the using the lantern? Okay, let's go here. And let's go back. I mean I didn't hear explosion and I, I don't know, let's see. Where was it? Here. not set up the explosion before you are safely out of the blast area. Okay, but how exactly do I set it up anyway? Yes, throw a, throw a fucking rock at an explosive mixture. I was right. <laughs> okay. It. Wait, is that in the hall with the elevator? Uh, the game didn't want to <laughs> show us the explosion, so they said, go away from the blast area. Okay, um... Explosions are hard to make in video games. Sweet. Okay, I think now we can use it. Some food. Uh, sweet. 
This bread is, uh... It's past its expiration date by probably a few th seconds or something, I don't know. It's, it's okay to eat. Defo. Machine parts, okay. I thought this was a stick food storage. Well, it is, but... I thought, like, it's the old thing. Well, I don't think we'll be hearing from her anymore. Okay. She really hates torches and chains. Hey, the chain. Wait, is that is that chain 2D? Oh my god, the chain is 2D, I think. Yeah, it is 2D, that's cool. Okay. I'm really <laughs> wondering about stuff that I shouldn't be wondering about. Anyway. Machine parts storage. Oh my god, finally. It's full set of free rods in is an it's if a full set of free rods is unavailable, there is one rod in the inner study rooms. Yeah, I already have that one. Always use spare rods in the storage. Yes. Shit. Sexy boy. Should I stand here so he doesn't notice me? It. Maybe it's the girl. Oh, for the level fuck. Okay. Okay. Fuck off. Where should I hide? Where can I hide? In the barrels. Oof, okay, that got me. I thought he was gonna pass. Out. Wooded. Head is pounding and hands are shaking. Duh. I need to crack my knuckles. Oh, right, it's Tuba Crouch. That's why probably it is Tuba Crouch. Yes, it's Tuba Crouch to crack my knuckles. Alright, let's. Uh, I don't have a sanity potion. We can run for it. Where is he? Let's run for it. Let's fuck out. We have the rods. We don't need nothing else. I'm out. Oh, I'm out. Oh, I'm out. Oh, oh shit. Okay. Right under there. He's here now? God damn it. Okay, what should I do? Can I throw a barrel at him? Here. Yes, I can. Well, kinda. Okay, let's build a fort. And hide. I'm trying to say is that I'm not really enjoying this game as much as I'm supposed to be. I'm sorry about that. I'm just so fucking tired. 
Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Fuck this door. Don't actually. That's gross. Here. Shit! 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 Go! 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 Don't look back! Don't look back! He's not behind you. Totally not behind you. Go! Oh. Let's hope he cannot open these types of doors. Oh my god. What? Oh, it's the red tumors, okay. I need some sanity potions, like, immediately. Or maybe I just need to stare at some light. Light. Look, Daniel, it's light. Okay, it's better to control. Look at that effect, that's amazing. Okay. Probably need the glasses, but I don't have them in, in here. Okay, let's just take the rods there and let's get the fuck out of here. I hope they are not supposed to be specified by the colors. Sorry. Sorry if I'm not reading these. I think that we wrote read all those. Now oh, you got better for your brain being a raisin. Okay, where was that? Is that flies? PlayStation. Maybe it is actually by the colors of PlayStation. <laughs> well, there's no X, so no. Do I just have to guess? Close start four base. Trinity Stream. Machine part made out of wood and metal. Trinity Stream flow cycle. How did I do that? Okay, let's let's go. So can I now activate? Is it still burning? Damn, what kind of coal is that? Okay. There we go. Now, 99.9% .9 sure that the monster is going to be up there. Woohoo! You better now? Oh my god, he's absolutely better. Okay, so the elevator is open on it. You ain't getting rid of me. I'm gonna grab this player for protection. Hello. Is that red stuff maybe not there? Is, it, is Daniel like just imagining it? Im imagining it? Okay. Is he like, I don't know, like, I don't know, maybe stepping on rocks, that's what hurts him. Okay. What? Oh my god, I thought someone was standing in front of me. Okay. Crystal clear. Oh my god, you're a fucking insane person. Elevator part done, I think. Down. What if I want to go there? Way too slowly for it to be this much of an impact. Carefully treading the unknown land, he looked over his shoulder at his traveling com travel companions. The out outrider touched the brim of his hat as he 
Oh god. We're okay, we're okay. The elevator fell. Come, this way. What was that? Forgive me, I should have warned you. One of my responsibilities as a baron is that of a prison warden. This is where criminals are locked up. Like a dungeon? Very much so. Come, don't linger. Oh, God. Judging by this being a jail cell door, I'm not going to be excited about the next part. Fucking purely dark here. I'm not gonna survive without oil. Should really start running. No. 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 Sir, you seem to be having problem with a monster. Should really start using my fucking tinder boxes. Picked up a hammer. It's ready to bash some dighead. There are shackles here. Thanks. So hey, kid. Of course I'm doing this now that it's locked. The only door is trying to protect me. Okay. Jesus. Hello! Okay, okay, okay. We're not going that way. No, no, no. See ya later. Jesus, okay. How the fuck am I gonna defend myself? He comes here. No, I have a hammer, but let's just hope he doesn't come here. Shit. Okay. Got this, come on. I'm gonna throw the chair when he comes there, then we're gonna run. Oh shit, he didn't do shit. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. We've got a very golden chance. Okay, I think we're good. Nope. <laughs> Just making things worse. Look, this is no place for a young girl all by herself. She could be hurt or worse. There's no telling what horrors await down there. Shit, is this gonna be keep happening? The torches. But mother, I don't want to leave without you. Hurry, child. You must go. Find Gabriel, the outlaw, and tell him to alert the king's men. No, you come too. Please, we don't have time to make the hole any wider. But Somebody's coming. Hurry. I'll cover the hole with the bed. Everything will be fine. I promise you. Why can't the mother go too? Yeah. Shit, where? Where is she? Jeez. Hammer? Yes. Fuck 
off. Can we use the chair to walk it? Wait, is that her? Oh god, no. She said she'll block the hole with the bed. And we can use that. Oh Jesus, don't tell me that's the little girl. Choose starf. Well it's just two bones, so I don't think. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh thank god at least. What did I get in that room, actually? <laughs> Tools for stone cutting. Oh! I think I know what to do. After, we'll have enough time. Okay, let's not go, not go, not good, not good. This is not good. Rock, stone, whatever. Fuck. Fuck off. Stay there. Good boy. What's this? It's firmly locked. Got it. Oh god. Yeah, I know leaning with the screen won't help me. Okay. Where was it? Here. Yes. Um. This looks like it. No, it doesn't glow. to find some rocks that are like bitly damaged to use the stone cutter on bitly that's that's best english man slightly this every rock in the fucking corner looks slightly damaged Are all of these voices just like Daniel's memories? Memories. We need to run away from that ugly bitch. Okay. Got a bucket. And I'm not afraid to use it. But oh, oh shit, he's in new buckets. Okay. Oh, 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 Oh Jesus, alright, not don't look at him. He's not there. I need to go there though. I don't think that's that I'm actually in a very good position right now. Is there anything that I can stop him? Shit. Am I fucked? Well, I can just get let myself get hurt once, but even looking at him is going bad. Alright. Hey buddy. Ow. And I think I should just let him, let him kill me. That's not, that's not how it's supposed to play games. I mean, if, I think I can mount him in if I'll make this good. Stop shaking, Daniel. We have a golden chance here. There we go. See? Oh shit, he can come through. Okay, I did it. 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 Run, Daniel. Run. Run. Okay. Fuck's sake, man. This is some action. 
What is this? Is this my sanity? <laughs> uh, okay, that's kind of cool. Oh no, it's real. Okay, I have enough oil. <sighs> Shitting spree, man. Okay. Oh my god. Alright, I should just look through each jail cell and see if there's a broken wall. And it would help if the screen would start shake stop shaking. Whatever whatever this effect is, bloom maybe. It's horrible. Somehow my head starts to hurt from that. Cell area two. Shit! Back here? Damn it! <laughs> Whoa, okay. <clears throat> Tinderbox. That's helpful here. I just need to do something in my head. I haven't seen a sanity potion in so long. Okay, let's go here too. Check the walls. Maybe makes sense to go through here to go to the other room, but no. What's this? Oh, we've already been here. Shit. Well, the fact that she said that it's being blocked by a bed doesn't necessarily mean that it has to be like that. It was just one dialogue. I don't think many people would really pay attention to a detail that's this important. But it is a good step up, you know, it's, it's a good lead. There we go, okay. Prison, no, no, no. The hole is too narrow to slip through. Okay, the morning sun flickers between the pine trees as the carriage approaches the castle. A faint memory of reflections in the window pain repeated itself over and over. Okay. There's a change of paste. Left or right, left or right, left, left. Right then. Sorry. So, uh, <clears throat> sorry for having to leave. That was my Discord. <clears throat> um, our dog had a haircut. <laughs> what an excuse. Okay. So, is this is where the girl went through, or the mom? The girl.
No, it's actually a good way to like, if you want the people who play your game to listen to the story, um, have a piece of dialogue, give a huge hint to a puzzle that's actually hard, but with that hint it's much easier. It's a good idea, because that actually makes the people listen to the story. Which I'm trying to do, I just sometimes don't understand it. Kitchen. Of course she's a woman and she already goes to the kitchen. <clears throat> Sorry, no gender stereotypes. Fuck those annoying shits, okay. 2nd of August, 1839. I have arrived at the village of Altstadt. Altstadt. It's a haven in the midst of a vast forest and the last stop before my final destination. Castle Brennenburg. It's late in the evening, and the outrider, who has been with the coach since Bremen, advised me to wait until morning before I venture further. I've arranged for a bed at Der Mühle, the village's only inn, and am now waiting for the sun to rise. I try to sleep, but as I close my eyes, I see the men who fell victim in London. My fear and shame forces me to witness the same scenes over and over. They are dead because of me. Oh, he didn't do anything wrong. I think. <laughs> I mean, usually these type of people just say it's all their fault, even though they just followed somebody who's clearly fault it actually is. <laughs> just a kill. Oh god. <laughs> okay, some sort of acid. Okay. Yeah, let's just poke our fingers at unknown chemicals. Okay, this is now not pickable. Pick the pick up a little bubble that I write in. There is a barrel filled with acid in the kitchen. Okay. Nothing. Something in here. Cooking. Oh shit. Okay. Everything can damage me. A wounded wound is be bleeding quite badly. Wait, which one? What, where did I cut myself? The acid, maybe? Hello! You, would you like some acid thrown on your fucking ugly face? Wait. Shit, I just fucking scrambled the barrels. Boxing. Okay. I wonder if I can work in distraction. Is there more of those? Gate is long and the padlock is in, ex in excellent condition. Stone cutter could be used for that. Okay. What language is this, by the way? Does somebody know? Kulina? Kulina is actually like uh, cooking in Czech. Well, not, not really. It's, it's kind of complicated. It's like the, the job if you're cooking. Uh, the career of cooking is called kulinarsky, kulinarstvi, so maybe it's a European, well of course it's European, but what language is that? <laughs> I'm really not getting to a point, am I? I'm just trying to explain something that I myself don't know. Okay. I am also surprised that I haven't made a vagina jokes about these holes. Storage. Re what does it say? Receptaculum. Mm, okay. I don't think that language is made up. That sounds like an actual language. Shit. 
I feel like I have fled the world and all its worries. Brennenberg is a majestic creation perched upon a forest-clad hill with towers reaching well above even the highest pine trees. Following the winding road leading to the gates gives the impression of discovering something forgotten, as if journeying with Marco Polo to the hidden Xanadu. Alexander, the Baron, is a peculiar but gracious man. He seems well-versed in worldly matters, and is not at all as eccentric as I assumed. My room is exquisite, and I'm confident that no hotel for miles could even hope to match it. As the sun sets on Brennenberg, its fairy tale varnish turns to an eerie gloom. Alexander's strange servants are never far away. They are a quiet lot, and their behavior could only be described as skulking. Alexander seems pleased by my presence. As he puts it, it seems like I got here just in time. Hmm. I'm not gonna act like I know what the fuck he's saying. <laughs> Shit. Great way to put it. Okay, I'm staying here. Soon we'll be ready. Let there be enough time. He escaped. Where is he now? that for a fucking lamp oil lamp lamp of oil oil for the lamp of oil oh, oil for the oil lamp thank god for that <laughs> acid in what's a plate again these actually use those for acid I don't know why I cannot grab them now this kind of work actually has comments which is good that shimmering 
Daniel, you're one sick bastard, I think. Oh. Well, you're god fucked up. Have yeah, this thing, though, thank you. Is that loop? <laughs> What kind of memory do you have of this place, hey, man? Anybody, help! Christ! I don't believe this. Why? Why? What do I do to deserve this? I mean, it can't you be. Deserve this? Do I deserve this? It wasn't my fault. Why did he have to go in there? I don't go into burning houses. He should have known better. Burning houses, what? 4th of August, 1839. The nightmares woke me in the early morning, and for a moment, I forgot where I was. Shortly after, there was a knock on my door. Alexander had heard my screams and asked me to join him. As we drank oh, our shit, tea, sorry. Alexander well, began to tell me what he knew. It seems like the orb I found casts a long and dark shadow. It's not only a powerful item, but a dangerous one. Simply by touching it, you invoke the powers within, and if you are too weak to control it, it will devour you. The shadow is a sluggish thing, lagging behind the wielder, oh, killing no, anyone or anything in its path to reclaim the orb. I said I didn't care about its powers, and that I should throw it away. Alexander advised against this, as I'd still be a part of the path to the orb, and eventually There's suffer death. Having the orb, I would at least have the chance to fight back when the time came. I asked Alexander what he meant when he said he could protect me, and he answered that things can be done, but at a price. At a price. Have this spoiled bread if that's enough. <laughs> Shit, where? Acid. By the way, this episode should have been over long ago, but there's no safe door. Maybe on some of the red tumors again. Okay. No, don't kill her. 
The lock. Shit, no. Oh wow, a Faro's must smart for once. It said it there was this one log that had a comment that it's just made of metal. That sounds like a bit of a hint that maybe the acid would be for that. How are the these torches blow out, don't they? Where was the freaking thing though? Here? I think so. Yes. Fuck yeah, I knew it. No? That's just a really weak in the padlock. There we go. Nope. Okay. He unraveled the cloth protecting the orb. Alexander reached out, picked it up, and held it against the light. Cover it, he said. Keep it covered at all times. Holy shit. <laughs> well, this will be it for this episode. So if you liked it, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't just dislike it, I would actually very much understand why. Because this episode, in my opinion, well, I didn't give enough energy into it. Which I'm really sorry for, but I'm I'm just incredibly tired. And also, I, I, I don't know, man. It's, this fucking COVID thing sucks. But, yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. So, bye.